There's a Reddit thread going on. I don't know if you've seen it, where millennials are posting about what Gen Zers are missing out on. Right. They will not partake in these things. And let's Never go get through to experience. Yes. And some of it, I don't know, maybe good, maybe not. But on the list, I thought we just rattled through some of these. And tell me what you think. Uh, one, is, one is a Thomas Guide. Now, many of you listening have never used a Thomas Guide. But a Thomas Guide was a paper, like, a notebook, thick, thick notebook, the size of an encyclopedia. It was like a phone book, right? A phone book, mm -hmm. yeah. It looked yeah. kind of thick as a phone book, but big like that, where you would, to get anywhere in L.A., you'd have this grid system and map system, and you'd flip your through the hard pages to find your directions. And I'd have my Thomas Guide in the passenger seat of my car. I think about this honestly on a regular basis because I get lost when I even when I have directions on my phone. I always think, what did they do back in the day when they didn't have? You'd have to sort of map it out ahead of time. But I mean, yeah, I I would map quest on a, a computer before I would leave my house. So I'd have that. I never had a Thomas guide. I think Thomas is very sad that the phone was invented. <laughs> that was yeah. not having a, a good last couple of years. Uh, let's see what else is on the list that. Millennials are posting that Gen Zers will miss out on. Listening to a radio with a blank cassette in your boombox, hoping yeah. to record your favorite song. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I used to do that. You get the DJ talking. Actually, this is going to sound ironic, but I would be so pissed when the DJ was talking over the song <laughs> I wanted. Oh, really? Yeah, because you just wanted a clean song. Yeah, I'd get upset if I hit record. Like if, if, it, if I came in the middle of my favorite song and I had to record just half of it, you know? Yeah. That is the station that was fun. Pop up. Um, let's see. Flipping through a CD's liner notes when you first got it. The liner notes oh, of, the, yeah. of the CD. Um, actual blind dates. Remember there was a time when you could actually go on a true blind date. You did your friends told you about them, you were set up, and then boom, that first impression was in person. They would see your first reaction. You know, I'm not upset that I didn't get to experience that. I like doing my research before. I, I agree. First of all, dating, I'm just not a fan of anyway. But blind dating, especially without being able to see them or know something about them first. It's no. a hard no for Don't me. like phys physical I illness. Don't physical illness. I think those are dead yet. I think you can still kind of get a solid blind There's date. There's nobody, Patty, no that goes chance. out on a date that doesn't look them up on social before. I guarantee no you. Mm. Trust. Trust.